Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I played this game with uh, people from my Twitch stream, uh, and I won a game without having any grain or weed or whatever you want to call it. So I figured it would be a fun game to share uh, with you guys on YouTube. Uh, if you like this uh, video, be sure to uh, to subscribe to my channel and to join in my uh, Twitch stream sometime. So uh, enjoy. It'd be pretty cool to get it. What? What? No, 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 no. We're, <laughs> we're three. No. Huh? I only saw three three people in the loading screen, but I guess we're at four people. So, if you guys can come up with a name for our guild, that will be pretty cool, I guess. So, the players that are in the game, please mute right now because I will be analyzing the board, and I prefer you to not hear it. Uh, I'm third placement. Uh, that's the worst placement of all let's analyze this board there's very low grain and I like grain and I like my ore that's also pretty low ore uh, so let's see what happens I think this spot would be my preferred spot here just to get you know get that grain going but maybe a wider strategy will be good here there's high wound producing here big sheep board though yeah exactly yeah and here's the sheep harbor so this will be a good spot as well placing it here get your road towards there and then maybe as a second placement put it here put it there to get an instant road get to this harbor fast so yeah it's all possibilities but we'll just have to see first what uh, Omega Lolo or Arnie Alberts as he's called in the game uh, will do uh, let me see Thank you, my chat in game is not working. It's, it's no problem, Frada. Uh, Bramobs, Moroccan, probably totally off wall. Yeah, that's pretty far off, but <laughs> I guess it's pretty funny. Uh, I guess I can pronounce this name like in, in my own uh, in my own language. It's Agni Amberts. So I guess that should, that should sound pretty European. So yeah. I'll, I'll give you one more guess and if you don't get it I'll, I will tell what, where where I am from so Omega Lolo goes for this spot he I, I think it's a pretty good spot he has highest grain producing spot on the on the map he does block this spot that I would have liked so I guess we are aiming for this one but well we'll first have to see what Ferrada will do but I'm aiming for this one I'm aiming for this one and, and this one. Here I will get instant road. I will have good rule. I'm close to that harbor. And it's an interesting board. I guess it's a funny board for a community game. There is also only one one good uh, clay producing tile. This one is also pretty good. Yeah, it's, mm, mm, it's an interesting board. So Ferrata goes for this one, for that one. We're going for this one. Let's do it quick to put some pressure on uh, on Bob or Zygon as he's called in, in the game. So we really would like this spot. I don't think Bob will take it. Oh, or this spot. Uh, this spot would be even better, but this one probably will be taken. Uh, but this one would be the dream to get this one get a road towards there. Maybe we can get longest road then uh, We'll have the bottom of the of the board for ourselves the bottom of the island Yeah, this would be the dream and this would be our contingency contingency uh, Contingency plan. Yeah, it, it will not get any better than that pronunciation So this would be the dream and maybe we can get that second if we cannot get any of those, uh, I'll guess I'll go for this one maybe just to get some more room, get some more ore, and then also go for this harbor. So we will we will we will have lots of ore. We can use the harbors as good as possible. Oh, I forgot to turn on the the characters from history. So I'm Ab Abraham Lincoln. Bob the Stoner is uh, Genghis Khan. Uh, Omega Lolo, 
for Arnie Alberts, as he's called in game, Rob is called Saigon in game, is uh, Julius Caesar, and Ferrata is uh, Mansa Musa. So Bob does take this pot, which I understand. So hopefully he doesn't take that one. Uh, so I guess uh, this 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 the evening this night is about breaking my own rules, right? Because I will not have any weed. So interesting. Should I go for this one just for the weed? But this weed is so low. So I guess we're committed to this strategy right now. We need high wool. And this the highest producing wool on the map, and it gives me an instant road to go to this harbor. And I guess, I guess these games are all about uh, having fun, right? Especially in the community games. So we're placed it towards there, so we can go to uh, to this three to one harbor, get to this wool. Uh, no one can place a village here. They could place it there, could place it there as well. But I'm not expecting that to happen. Uh, let me see purple still needs some wool, but yeah, he could place it there Green also would need some wool, but he could place it there So yeah, we'll place our road towards there and hopefully no one places a uh, village there and competes for us with the wool uh, Wool harbor. Yeah, no no gray no wheat no wheat means defeat right, but let's Let's do it this I've seen people win without grain. It, it's it's not impossible. Definitely on, on a low grain map as this. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. I guess it's it's fun to try something. Uh, lots of chats in the game. Okay, now we're in. I've muted the stream. Muted now. Good luck on a fun. I know timer. Uh, and for guild name, if not taken, guess could could be Katan University. Yeah. So Bob is the second one to to say yo let's do Catan University. Uh, I'm calling good luck, have fun real quick. Uh, yeah, I think Catan University should be in there. I'm not sure how long the name can be, but I also like you know Catan University uh, Wheat Squad or something like that. You know, I want to also include you into into the name, the viewers. Mm. Don't do it, Green. Don't do it, Omega Lala. Don't place it here. Don't do it. Just go for this one. Don't do it. Come on. Don't do it. Come on. Oh, I hate it that there. I don't like it that there is no timer in these uh, custom uh, custom games and these community games. Uh, <laughs> Come on, don't do it, don't be. I hate it that it takes so long. Just go towards there. Come on, or go towards there even if you, yeah, cool, cool, cool. I'm happy with this. So hopefully no one steals our road away. Uh, if they steal from us, they don't steal our, uh, our brick. And we have a risky strategy this game. No, don't steal it from us, come on. I hope we don't have a target on our back this game. I'm pretty connected with purple. It could block this uh, wound or this ore. But he probably should block this, right? In early game, the the lumber and the brick are very important, so I guess he should he should block this. And for the people uh, that what that have watched me uh, in uh, previous streams, yeah, they they they, they really shouldn't. <laughs> they should think, well, what are you doing? Are you the same guy? Why are you not getting grain? Last game, I uh, I didn't go for wool. So yeah, I I guess we're broadening broadening our view. <laughs> so we kept the roads. Pretty happy with it. And we'll have to go to. Do this wool harbor as fast as possible and hope for a two, for a nine. <laughs> I'm not sure how we're going to do this. We'll we'll try. We'll see how far we get. We do get a nine here. But we're ha we don't have any availability to, to grain. So this ore is just a trading good, preferably for grain, but I don't think anyone wants to give give the grain away, so 
I guess we'll have to hope for uh, for four ore that we can exchange or we can trade for a uh, grain and go for <laughs> for the village. But it won't be a uh, won't be a hard one. Hoping for a too long, you say. Yeah, that, that's how low we got. We're we're hoping for a two. Like every game has 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 one two, right? Or some have none, but most have the one. So we don't hit anything here. Who wants to give me brick? I know there's brick in the game. Let's see. I think it's the first trade that was offered. So Bob might want to do it. For I I taught you guys too well. Always if so so I'm the I'm the guy who wants to have something right. So we're getting pretty lucky on the or. I'm the guy who wants to to get something. So always if someone wants to get something from you, always ask a lot. So in this example, I'll ask a lot. I'll go for the brick because I know there's more brick in the game than uh, grain. So I'm expect them. I expect them to be more willing. Yeah, I'll I'll do this because my range on getting a uh, lumber is way bigger than a uh, a brick. And I'm a player that likes to trade, uh, definitely in the early game. Um, so I gave uh, Bob lumber, although he doesn't have any lumber supply. But yeah, if we're both happy with this trade, I'm fine with it. So there we got our uh, fourth ore that we need. So we're, we've been pretty lucky on that, that part. Yeah, we've been very lucky. So we can exchange this for a grain. So the only thing we need is a nine right now, <laughs> and then we, yeah, we we are we're good. I think uh, Omega Lolo has very good setup here. Uh, I think yeah, he was first placement, and he chose this one. I think it's a very good first placement, uh, and he's combining it with this harbor, right? So he's playing very well, very good. Uh, both Ferrata and Bob the Stoner have development cards already. So we roll a 7 here. Uh, does someone have grain? Has grain? Have the, uh, or or uh, lumber or grain? Doesn't really matter. So let me check. I don't know. Omega Lolo. Omega Lolo still has one lumber. Uh, but no grain. So we have to trade. Uh, we have to steal from uh, from Omega Lolo from Green. So, I guess I'm going uh, red as a development card. Uh, purple has one as well, so I'll place it there. We get a wool, that's okay. The chance of us getting that lumber wasn't so big. So we get our grain, we only need a nine right now. <laughs> We're, we got our first footage. Uh, if we get a uh, six or a five, we also get our first footage. Uh, but preferably we hit the 9 so we can build a footage and we can use this sheep. So we hit the 9 here, very happy with it. We do go over seven seven uh, cards right now, so that's kind of dangerous. Uh, no, nope, not doing that. So if you can build a village right now, we still have three wool, and we can use the wool to to do what? To get grain, probably. To get grain, and because the grain is so low on this map, we still have a chance on getting largest army, I think. Yeah, we would be able to buy a development card immediately, and we always like to have a knight in our hands. Having a knight in our hands, uh, no, 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 I'm not giving this grain away. Having a knight in our hands is always good if we get blocked, so we can remove it. Um, that's why I place it on green right now and not on purple on our on our or on red.
So we could do some. Uh, so the guys who are not playing and we're in chat. Uh, for, for whom are you uh, rooting for? Who, who would you like to see to win? Uh, so we can do some propaganda in this game. Like uh, this, this game is for fun, right? So we can do some propaganda. We can say, "Yo, Green is getting way too strong. He already has a city. Such an early city is strong." Um, I don't like to do it in normal games, but I guess in community games it's fine. In normal games, um, I don't like it because I think if you talk too much, you will get a target on your back. But I guess in a community game, uh, it could be fun to to add some propaganda. So there's a tree. There's lots of grain on the game not in the game right now. Don't really like it, but cannot really do anything about it. So red goes for another development card. Uh, I guess the race has started right now. We do block this eight, and we're just hoping for lots of sixes, lots of fives. Uh, maybe it would be good to build a city here as soon as possible. So we could keep the knight. Uh, let the largest army go for now and just focus on our uh, on our sheep farm. And if we have a city here, uh, we only need one nine and two fives uh, for another city. So I think that's the way to go, to go for a city there. But uh, I do kind of have the feeling that this, uh, this could be my first lost community game. So I'm going to, to get some propaganda in. Uh, Green is getting strong. Just some subtle, subtle propaganda, not nothing too much. So we have a double nine, uh, but we do not have any shared numbers, no double numbers. Uh, it has been different uh, on on other games tonight, but uh, the nine is the only double number. But it gives us uh, three resources as of now, and if we get that city going, we will get we will get four resources just from one one roll, and that's kind of dangerous because it puts you over seven really quick. So a nine now would be kind of nice, but we get a six. So we, we again we have lots of wool and I think we we just should go for uh no I guess I'll just get one grain so I have some more flexibility uh to, to trade this in and also when I get robbed right now uh, the chance of, of them stealing my grain is lower. So if I would have gotten two grain right now I would be a target, at least in my opinion, to steal from me. If you're looking from for grain and you know oh the only resource someone has is grain then you go for that one so the sheep farm the wound farm is working pretty good we have uh, I, I'm not sure who taught uh, someone there was uh, this this guy in chat who learned me and uh, who, who learned me a new word it was pasture I think I have lots of pasture meaning like land that sheep can <laughs> walk on I didn't know that word but I know now I have lots of pasture and uh, yeah the sheep farm is working pretty well I'll do this I don't think green would do it but you never know what? <laughs> I think that that's how I pronounce it. Or oh, I'll call you Fert. Fert, uh, Fert. From now on, yeah, I'm going for a uh, for a city. Uh, I want to get the sheep farm rolling. Uh, our entire uh, our entire strategy is uh, focused on this sheep harbor. We're doing kind of a cheesy strategy, and when I get a city here, we have a, a tree. 
free tile income on uh, on ore I always like to have this uh, preferably I have it in combination with a uh, with a grain city so I can get uh, another city with two rolls uh, but having a city here I think is very good at, for me at this point so we hit a nine here which is very good for us we're close to the, to the towards that city but we but we really want to do something here because we have seven cards so let's roll first we get the six that's enough we don't have to use our knight I would have used my knight I think because I really wanted to do something development cards uh, I'm focused on from now on but I really like this city death card or Pecht, Pecht is correct I think Pecht you say how do you know how many RS to put when you log in um, not sure what R RS means, uh, YT1. A resource? I, I don't know what RS means. And um, Fricht says it's 10. Oh, he's asking you, oh, <laughs> how many, I know, how many R's you have to put it? <laughs> it's 10. <laughs> really? Uh, it, it seems less, but now I look at it. Yeah, I guess it's 10, yeah. But yeah, that's a really good question, YT1. <laughs> that's a really good question. I always so yeah I guess if when it's your username you know you have a system to log in but sometimes when I see like these really weird really weird usernames uh, yeah I think how do they log in that's so hard and I don't like to save my uh, <coughs> save my uh, username so we get a nine here nine is a very good number for us and I would like uh, I would like that brick. It's not weird where you come from. Really, it isn't weird. Where, where do you come from? It's it's, it's like your username a uh, a regular name in your uh, in your country. Yeah, I would like some grain. I'm fine with it. Why do one well, all your passwords are saved in the Google account? Yeah, I, I don't like it. I like to. I'm afraid that I will lose them pretty much if I. I guess <clears throat> there is an argument to be made for to save them in your Google account, but when you have to log in in a on another device, I don't know the password, and I kind of don't like it for uh, privacy purposes. I guess. Uh, I, I always think yeah, well, then it's saved somewhere, and I don't know. So we're getting lucky with the nines, I think. Yeah, we're getting pretty lucky with the nines. Seven should be rolled way more often. The eight and the four as well, but there haven't been many dice rolls so far. So let me check. We get a four here. So we have to do something. We have nine, uh, nine resource cards. We got very lucky with the nines. So at least we're going to do this, right? Um, but the question is, what will we do with all this ore? Hopefully, someone wants to give me something for it. I really don't want. I, I don't want much. I, I would take pretty much anything right now. Anything except the lumber. I've got lumber income, and I I don't need any lumber for. Uh, Yeah, I would even take sheep, but I, I prefer to do this. But I would take one sheep for uh, one ore here. But I prefer to do this, and uh, Ferrata wants to do it, so I'm taking this one. And uh, just to get less cards, uh, I'm trading it in for a uh, grain. So this uh, puts me in range for, uh, for a city, I guess, with a 12 but also with a five I'm in range for a city and also I could go for development cards so we'll see what happens uh, most common name in Canada you say really Fert? 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 I have some uh, relatives in Canada uh, some family but I never knew that uh, Fert was most uh, common name in Canada Canada I guess Canada Canada 
or is that too American? Canada. It's 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 uh, screwed over there. It, I like to you know. <laughs> I guess it's on the stream now. But <laughs> yeah, it's on the stream. Uh, you say uh, why is it uh, so bad there? Let me know. Hmm. We get hit by a seven year. I guess we're losing our aura. Mm, we only so we'll do it like this we only need one lumber for the settlement and we would like to keep the tree ore so we keep in range for a city don't steal my okay that's okay ish that's okay ish so let's uh, do a, a situation report a sit rep I'm not sure how to call it uh i think green is winning so far he has one development card no one has played any knights yet so i'm wondering if they have the uh, victory points here uh who has best set up for longest road uh, i would like red to to block this right because green had to, uh, i would have to go all the way here i guess this harbor would be very good for for uh, omega lolo yeah i think we have to uh be fast for uh for the <coughs> largest army here but maybe <laughs> i'm pretty sure no one wants to give us grain <laughs> green green ah so, <laughs> so no one wants to give us grain, but maybe someone wants to give us wool and then we still can get our city going so no one wants to do it so i guess we could build a village here right but i think i would like to stick to my ore for now and go for a victory card we need victory cards anyway and i'll use a knight to remove it uh, um i would like brick and they all have development cards so mm. Hmm. I'll place it there. Because green has only one development card and he had uh, he had brick. No, it's uh, generally pretty great there, you say. Yeah, I, I think. Oh, we had our we had our two. I told you I called it Y2 and I called it. We would get this two. Now we only need a five and then then we have to settle it. I don't want any ore. <laughs> two, yeah, two. <laughs> it's like you knew a four would be rolled. Yeah, no, but this is. Uh, I, I didn't talk about it as of today, I guess. Uh, uh, today yet. Uh, but the rubber, when you place the rubber on a rubber on a tile. Uh, it gets the number gets rolled a lot the turn after so if I use a knight or a, if I roll a seven and I know <laughs> I like his optimism I like his optimism but if I move the rubber to a four for example uh, the chances that uh, Bob or Zygon rolls a four are very big or very big bigger as normal um, it's something in the game nobody really understands it but most people agree it, it's not a coincidence anymore if you watch the the yeah now the, now the 12 you say oh two and that will be amazing right uh, but if you watch the stream a lot of your or even if you just played the game a lot you will see if you place the rubber on this six for example the six will be rolled a lot and I do know some players that use it as a strategy even so if I would really be in need for a wound I will place it there just so the chances that I get a, a wound would be bigger so I get robbed here and um, I, I think my uh, my grain was I'm not sure even what got robbed from me <laughs> we get another two yeah our grain was robbed right 
So it is hurts, and we have six cards, and we kind of have to do something, but I'm not sure what. I, I cannot build an easy road for another village. So this is a tough one. This is a tough one. I guess we're... We'll have to uh, to take a gamble here and to see how uh, to see if it works. Ah, I should have used my knight there because this five would really have helped me, even though it would have gotten me over the seven resource cards. So, Ferth, uh, what time is it at you? I think it's like uh, six hours before uh, European time or Central European time. So let me take a gamble. I think it should be uh, about 6, 6 p.m. at your place. But I really enjoy it that people like all over the world uh, tune in for the, for the stream. Yeah, it's 6 o'clock for you. Yeah, six, yeah six, and why do you one for you? Yeah, I think Israel is one hour later as my, uh, my place. And I'm not sure, let me check if uh, Bram, Bram, Bram ups, yeah, Bram's ups, if he's still there, but I gave him quite a few tips for, for where I live right now, so. Uh, we got a seven here, uh, we got, we, I think we, just because we are re, right, <laughs> we have a target on our back, I'm not sure, I don't want any lumber. Uh, uh, or it got stolen from us from us <laughs> I, I was just about to say but then I noticed how ridiculous it was I was about to say ah 12 would be nice for us but <laughs> I guess we're oh what oh, we missed this 12 we weren't here yet we're kind of dependent on twos and 12s in this game that's not a good sign if you're dependent on on twos and twelves. I missed this trade. Uh, I guess not. Mm, maybe I wanted to do it. So still, no one has played uh, any uh, uh, a knight yet. So yeah, we are playing a knight when we are because I don't like it being there. We like some more fives and some more six. Yeah, give me two gray now and I'll do it. I could have even uh, asked for less because I only need one brick for this village. Uh, he wants grain as well. Yeah, I don't have any grain in it, but he has to do some. I don't like it that he has, and he got longest road here. Does that make sense? Uh, kinda. No, but it, green really should go for longest road. But he's buying development cards. But I think green should go for longest road. He has best setup for it. So we roll a seven. We would like uh, no, yeah, a grain. We would like a grain, but. I don't think anyone has. Uh, Ferrara might, Ferrata might had, uh, might have it, or or he wanted to buy. Uh, I think he just built his road. I think it was a good move to build that road, because he had too many cards. But he also could have gone. He maybe he was going for a city. He did have an ore. To steal an ore wouldn't be. Uh, so bad either so they have two development cards all of them and they they aren't using it so I guess we're stealing from green because I would like this ore and we got the ore and I'm still afraid of him I think green is uh, green should get longest road on the long term longest road on a single tile yeah oh and we get a nine here which is fine but we still have a uh, full round to, to go so we probably have to give it away, but we'll see what happens. <clears throat> we 
could go for this one <coughs> to get even more uh, boom production for our sheep farm and it would help us to get longest road but I guess for we are in a good way for getting largest army even though they all have two uh, two development cards and they can't all have uh, victory points right because there are only five in the game if you don't know yet uh, I've told sometimes but there are 25 development cards in the game uh, 14 of them are knights uh, five of them are victory points and six of them are are, are uh, special development cards or whatever you want to call them uh, <laughs> no and out of those six uh, can, can we have out of those six uh, special development cards two are road building two are monopolies and two are uh, years of plenty no <laughs> If you give me some grain and so I'll do this I guess he's going for this this spot I think or hopefully he's breaking oh I know I hope he's competing with uh, green if red is competing with green for this spot oh if if green builds the settlement, I, I will I will say to Red, yo, block him off, man. He will get longest road. He is best set up for it. Damn, this is a tough choice. No, no, wait, wait. For two, I will do it because then I can get a settlement. I just need to wait the entire round. But no sevens a roll, right? Uh, seven is not a often thrown a roll number. Ah, <laughs> oh, and he does it with some someone else. Why doesn't he do it with me? And he's not even blocking green. So I'm, I'm using some propaganda again. Block green, green. Great. Ooh, no, it's too late. So yeah, Green is winning this game. <clears throat> GG Green. I guess I should use his name, right? Uh, no. <clears throat> So we have quite a bit of resources in our hands, uh, but we're just going for a settlement. I don't think it's very reasonable to go for <clears throat> for longest road here. Yeah, it's too late. Uh, but at least if they both have uh, victory point cards here, I guess it's not good for us but it's not bad either because we have a good possibility of getting a uh, largest army I'll do it for a uh, for a grain here feed purple roads you say yeah that might, ooh, yeah I, but does he have grain he does have grain and he uses a nighty ill I want to trade oh uh, and he steals my bread yeah, I guess it's okay if he wants to compete with green. It gives us more chance of getting a largest army and get our settlement and get our cities. So even though we don't have any grain, but most people don't have like a good grain uh, source here. Um, so we still could win with our uh, strategy as we always do with four cities and uh, largest army. So Roma 7 here. Oh, but I, oh, this this was painful, man. This was I should have used the knight. I I keep I forget it too many times. Way too many times. If I used the knight here, I could have kept all this ore, all of it. And now I have to give it away. So this was a mistake. Big mistake. And I don't want to lose from these guys, man. So I'll do. Uh, 
No, that's too much, but but I'll do this to you. I want to help purple a bit, I guess. So now we can use the wool to get some grain. And to get that. So do you want to do it again, uh, purple? <laughs> Let's do one more purple. That no no I I thought I was I was I would be able to get a development card. I'm keeping it. I want to get some cities going. I want to get a city there. Just for the sec for the second two that will come. I would like to get a city there, yeah. So this is a big risk, definitely with a city, if I hit a 9 now I go up to uh, nine, po 9 resource cards, no 10 resource cards and we do it to 9. So this is getting a bit dangerous. And again I should, yeah I should, oh, I forgot to use the knight again, it, I think it's getting too late and we get to 7 here. So I'm making quite a bit, a lot of mistakes right now, a lot of them. But well yeah, what you gonna do, I, well let's see it like this, if I used the knight then <laughs> the rubber would have been placed back on me immediately. But we did lose our, uh, what did we lose there, our, our uh, wound, yeah. I don't uh, need any lumber. I don't care about lumber at this point. So they are really uh, talking a lot. Not to use checking chat chat wasn't game lot, but yeah, should have. Yeah, you should have. But I understand. You cannot see a road building coming, right? Um. I don't want to trade with green. I'm kind of afraid of him. But I guess I'll still do it. What can he do with lumber? Get an even longer road? Maybe. And he's not... Yeah. No, he didn't want to do it apparently. So eights are not good for us. We want sixes and we want five. Five and six. And we want to use our knights. Right now, uh, hopefully, do we want to steal from green or from purple? Let me see. They all have, <laughs> the only thing they have is lumber, but I think purple also has quite a few uh, wool. And wool helps us, uh, but we get ore. So we do get this five here. So someone wants to do it. Oh, that's too much. Someone wants to do this. Get your ore back, purple. I know purple has uh, wool. So no, no one has grain. That's way too much. I'll do this. So purple and I am, are are getting buddies. We're <laughs> we're both happy with these trades. So I guess that's fine. And I'm not, you know, I'm not hoping for a twelve here. Maybe if someone wants to do this, I could get another city, and w that would be pretty nice. But it also won't be won't be bad to get another development card. So we'll see what happens. I don't think anyone wants to do it. There's a lot of lumber in the game. So we asking for a lot. Just say no if you don't want to. On Agalolo or on Arnie Alberts. So yeah. So I like that. He just said no. Don't want to do it. That's fine with me. I'll buy a development card. And I got three knights. Got most efficient route to a, lo a largest army. That's okay, I guess. So we're up to seven points right now. Uh, the only thing we have to do is upgrade all uh, everything to cities and use that uh, that knight, and we win. So that's what we're going for now, and the next city would go there. So some mines, a twelve would be nice, but 
uh, some nines, some fives, some sixes, and that are numbers that you can, you know, build on usually. So elevens don't help us, but that's okay. But nines, uh, fives, and six. Uh, Bert, I missed your comment. You hate to see it. I'm not sure. Uh, I guess it's probably something that I talked about before. Uh, Samskrit, Samskrit is now following. Thank you for following, man. Really helps me. Really encourages me on continue uh, with continuing uh, the stream. We do not need any lumber anymore, but we would like two wool for it. We know it's a very high wool game. Uh, and we don't need any lumber anymore. We just want to get four cities and get largest army. Uh, mm, mm. I'll do this. It gets us closer to uh, to our next city. So give me a woo and a four, and gets me a lot closer to our next city. You're welcome, dude. I was just playing with some friends and decided to jump on a stream. Uh, the further alert is too loud, you think? Um, I think that's something I can adjust. Or between games, or maybe even better uh, in between streams, YT1. Way louder than when you talk. Yeah, it's like a widget from, from this website. Um, so it's a bit harder to, to adjust. I won with two victory points. They had no idea. Yeah, that's the best sounds good. I think I have a, I have a video on YouTube. Uh, I think you should watch, but it's also a, in a clip on, or a clip and a highlight in my uh, on my Twitch channel. But I think it would be more fun to watch to watch the entire video. But yeah, it has something to do with victory point cards. But I don't want to spoil it. But victory point cards are uh, are the best. Lots of fours this round. Two in a row. Two in a row, yeah. You'll check it out. Yeah, cool. Yeah, it was a real fun game. And uh, the ending was just crazy. Your crazy end. Uh, it was really fun. It was last Friday, one week ago. But uh, cool that you're following. Cool that you're joined in the stream. And uh, yeah, hope you have some fun and hope you become a slightly better uh, Catan player. So we're looking for some nines, some fives, and some sixes. That's all we want. Some t uh, a ten would be fine as well, but prefer. Uh, I'll do this. <laughs> Does Red have? Yeah, Red has a three to one harbor, so he will not do that. But oh yeah. Uh, but preferably uh, nines because when we get a ten, we also help uh, red and green is green is doing pretty well. And if green has two victory point cards, it's over. So maybe I should have played the knight here. Probably I should have played the knight. But I guess in community games, it's just like in offline games. The only thing that counts is the win, right? The only thing that counts is the win. We don't play for elo in community games. You want to win. But I'm afraid that green uh, green will win. Uh, he can build a village here, then he's done. I'm, I'm expecting him to have two victory point cards. So when did he buy those development cards? Let me check real quick. And he bought one of those development cards last round. So if I'm lucky, he does not... Okay, he is a knight. I'm happy with it. But I'm turning around this knight next round just to get those victory points going. And he plays, ah, uh, and here you see what what will happen, what I've talked about before. The rubber gets placed on a tile and the number gets rolled right after it. It happens a lot of times. Uh, it's no coincidence, it's something in the game. Uh, I know it's really hard to write, you know, true random uh, code, I guess. So I don't blame the developers, but I don't know, that's, that's too much to ask. Let's do this. <laughs> it's really uh, hard to write random code, but this uh, happens a lot. Uh, nine is a real good number for us, though. We're, we were looking for it. 
a seven would be cool right now. Yeah, a seven would be amazing right now. But so we can see what he's got. Yeah, for the settlement, and uh, I think he has nine points because with this this uh, development card he has had for a long time. So he had a, a victory point and he had long uh, road building development card. Yeah. I, we have to use this knight, but I want to win these games, man. This uh, Omega Lolo, he, yeah, or Arnie Alberts, as he's called in games, he would be the first one to beat me in the, from the community. So I guess props to him, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to lose it. A seven would have been uh, would be really cool right now as well, because it really hurts them. But well. If they listen to my stream, they have to do something now. Especially Ferrada, he can do something now. Doesn't matter. Uh, doesn't. No, I don't want that. But I'll do this. Doesn't matter what he needs to do, but he has to do something to get rid of his cards. It's always to have. It's always better to have something on the board. Uh, I guess. Oh wait, he was. A, oh yeah, yeah, go for longest road. Steal it from uh, from green. I'm okay with this. I don't really need to lumber. Uh, I really need to wool, so this is this is good for us. Yeah, one more road and he get longest. I didn't even notice. So yeah, I guess we're still in the game, but now purple is close. <laughs> So here comes a city, yeah, he has 7 and maybe 8 points, always expect the worst, right? So this time we use the knight before we roll, we will not forget, uh, I'm pretty sure no one has uh, has, uh, has grain, uh, we would like some uh, wool or grain, but some wool is fine from red I guess, but I think... Uh, Omega Lolo, the green player, and the purple player, they are uh, closest, close, uh, close to winning. But I like to steal from red. I don't like the lumber from uh, from purple. So mm, I'll place it there. Oh. Ooh. So we're keeping this grain because we want to get uh, get a city going. We already have largest army. We only need to upgrade our cities. Hopefully our grain go does not get stolen here, but I'm afraid it will be placed here. And we do not have any knights now to defend. So yeah, that sucks, but nothing we can do about it. Yeah, it does get placed there, but luckily he gets our wool, and wool is, you know, it's okay for us, but the biggest problem, ooh, this is very good for us, very lucky, incredibly lucky. You know, I was just about to say, it doesn't really matter that he took our wool, but it's a problem that he blocked our ore income, but we get a 10 here, so 1, 5, 1, 6, or a 12, you never know. We get uh, our another, uh, another city, we get up to 8 points. We're still pretty okay on uh, securing largest army. Don't really care about this tree. Just want a five, a six, or a twelve. And now a five and a six. I don't think they have been rolled for uh, for quite some time. So Magalolo has three grains. So maybe he wants to do it. We'll see. Uh, some some skit if i'm pronouncing your name wrong just say it some skit something which i've been wondering about if you can build longest road really really uh, early early on in the game damn uh, shoot you i feel like it just paints a target on your back and you can build the longest road later on definitely man you're absolutely right there uh sometimes you want to do it because for example you want to make sure that no one can cut you off if you can, you can also buy a uh, build a real long road in the beginning of the game, uh, and pretty much uh, make sure that the other players, that it is very hard for the other players uh, to get the longest road after you. But it's always better to 
to to get the largest army or longest roads as late as the game uh, as late in the game as possible because uh, yeah you're absolutely right you will get a target on your back so I'll roll here very quick and we get our city or our second city we need two more and I don't think we need any development cards uh, I really need to take a quick bathroom break here so I'll w I, I don't like to do this normally but I really need to go right now so I'll see you in a two minutes or so was good <laughs> you could do a sneak long road by having two roads and connect them just when you need yeah why to yeah I like to do that so um, you know have to set up for your longest road ready but only take it when you need it and sometimes you want to take it just to be a bit faster as someone else is uh, because when you get five yeah uh, I'm, I'm sure you know if you get like five five roads then the other player that wants to steal them from you needs to get six etc so we w this is a pretty good rubber for us we don't care about lumber at this point at all we just want sixes fives twelve will be nice so some more nines but we get a seven here it could be nice but I obviously didn't see what happened last round let me check let me see did he use those? Yeah, he built a city. We know red has uh, one grain and some wool. Uh, red did buy a development card. I think I want to steal from uh, from green because I still think he uh, he could be pretty close towards finishing. So we'll steal from green. I know I probably will get it back, but we do steal our grain. Uh, unfortunately, we cannot build a city here. But I'm pretty happy with that grain. Uh, I'm pretty sure I will get it back right here. Uh, sounds good if you don't know. Normally, you don't want to place the rubber on someone who has a development card. Uh, but the, because the chance you will get it back, definitely if you have 8 points or uh, you at least have... Uh, you know decent spots that you will get it back so normally you would check who has development cards and who doesn't and if someone doesn't you want to place it on them because the chance of you getting it back is pretty high so lots of eights but we don't need eights we need sixes so we are pretty unlucky with the sixes so far uh, Green has a year's plenty, I'm fine with that because if he would have two knights, he would be close to largest army. If he would have two victory points, he would be close to winning. So, but he is going for victory points, uh, slash, uh, largest army. So, we need just need some good rolls, we're pretty close to winning. We need another nine, uh, and for example, two sixes, and we win. But we get blocked. I'm very happy they stole our brick there. We just want a 5, a 12, or a 6. Uh, yeah, a 5 or a 6, it's not that much to ask for. So we'll see. 5, 6, no, we get another 8. This hurts. This hurts. 
Uh, green could be closer as we think with all these eights. Oh, damn, damn. And oh, he didn't get uh, Lumber Harbor, so we should be pretty happy with that. And he also doesn't have a 3 to 1 harbor. Red does have a 3 to 1 harbor, and he has, he has four development cards right now. So we need some good rolls, and if we don't get uh, good rolls before the largest army gets get stolen from us uh, we are done and the five gets blocked now so we really want sixes but you know some sixes yeah, could happen should happen you can see the graph here it should be in the end it should be like a pyramid so so green player goes one I'm afraid he won't steal from me here I'm afraid Ooh, yeah, I'm happy he goes for the purple player. I think he's still going for uh, longest road here. And we had a five, finally. So we have the city in our hand right now. Uh, hopefully purple will not use a uh, knight. Uh, but he hasn't done it in a long time. So we at least can get up to nine points. But we want to win these games, right? We want to win them. The only thing that counts in these games is winning. And they must have a lot of victory points. So purple does use a knight. Please don't steal from me. Come on. Don't don't do it, man. Come on. Don't do it. No. No. Oof. So they're having a little beef, I guess. Oh no. <laughs> steal again from green. Come on. Put it there. No, 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 man. That hurt. That was bad luck. That was really bad luck. So he uh, could be up to nine points. Oh, we do hit the five here again, so that's that lucky, I guess. So we get the city, but we needed just a bit more luck last round, and so we could have won. But I, I think purple is really close. Uh, green could be closer, as we think. Even red could be closer, as we think, if he has three three victory point cards yeah that was bad luck man uh, I, I should have no I want to ask uh, grain for this I don't want wool but uh, I need grain <laughs> give me two grain come on pretty sure he doesn't have two grain but what always try just try no 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 we just need some six some six some five a ten we could still win i would like to keep my uh, perfect record up against community uh, players but well yeah you can't win them all so red ties me on the largest army but i still have it and he steals from me so it will be a very close game, but if Red steals largest army from me next round, I could I could be last. So I can win and I can get last. So I guess it's a fun game. And lots of victory point cards of uh, development cards. I mean, have been played. So two players tie me now for uh, for largest army. Oh no! Oh no! Not again, right? Don't place it here. So he uses a knight, places on a purple. Hopefully he doesn't place it here. Would be some bad luck. If everything is open for us, we still can win. We need a nine and we need a six and we win. And we have two rolls for it, so it's not a big chance, but we could still win. And if we don't get it this round, I think we are in a pretty bad place because uh, Red has... Yeah, Red will steal largest army from us. Very close game. Yeah, it is a very close game. It's fun. Red is closer as you think. If, I think he has two victory point cards. He get largest army and he goes up to uh, eight points. So it's it's very close. Yeah. Uh, we needed just a, just a bit more luck in those last rounds. And we <laughs> so green is trying to what is he trying to do here what does he what, what's he thinking i like his optimism but this is just a bit ridiculous pretty much but i like the optimism always try 
But we just needed a bit more sick, a bit more luck, less rounds, and we would have won. But now we could lose. So we get a 6 here. We need a 9 and we win. Just a 9. That's all we're asking for. If we get a 12 or a 5, we could go for the victory point card win. Uh, but preferably we get a 9 here. A 9 would win us the game. But well, yeah, I guess I shouldn't expect it. We'll see. Maybe someone wants wool and I can trade my wool very expensively here and extend my reach of on winning the game. No, yeah. <laughs> nope. And I think uh, Ferrata is only also on nine points, so it's very close. And he wants. Uh, he wants a road. I'm not sure why he wants a uh, brick, but he want he wanted an ore probably for a development card, or maybe he has exactly the resources for a for a city. But I don't think he has. Uh, let me check. No, he has wool. Ooh, no, no, no! Don't take my wool. But he could finish. Oh no no, he doesn't have a victory point card, so he can't finish now. But he can get up to nine points. Um, but I do like it that he doesn't have a victory point card because that means there still are some victory point cards in the game. So let's see. Come on, come on. Mm. So the only way we still can win is if we uh, steal a ore or we steal a grain here and we buy a development card so that's that's fun I guess <laughs> oh damn we know uh, purple has two grain does red only have grain place the uh, no no uh, green has seven cards Oh damn! We have to steal from purple. We have to steal a grain, which is like a one on five, twenty percent chance. I think they need cities or development cards, so we're going for this, and we get a break. So who wants to give us a grain? Give us a shot. Come on. Come on. Give us a shot. Green. Gah, come on. Give us a shot. Give us a shot at the win. Come on. They don't want to and uh, no there is there isn't uh, So we have to do this, I think. No, I can't. I cannot do it. I couldn't do anything here. And red will take my largest army here. We do hit the nine now. Oh, this, oh, we, oh, just one round. If we would have got this nine one round before, one turn before, we would have won. But now red will. <sighs> red didn't take largest army. Ooh. So hopefully this is a victory point card. Hopefully this is a victory point card. And he cannot, he, don't take Large's army away from me, come on. He probably would have used it, right? Don't take Large's army away from me. If he doesn't take Large's army away from me, it's GG. Even though, even if... Mm, no, so I can get two of those away, three, four, five, no. If he doesn't take largest army, uh, <laughs> we didn't, yeah, he cannot take largest army, and we cannot have a seven, then we win. <laughs> it's close, it's close, man. Oh. oh, but what does he have? I'm so curious now. What does Red have? Oh, yeah, now we win. This is it. I think we can call it. We can call it. GG. We can call it.
Oh, damn. Well, it was a fun game, man. It was close again. But I'm very happy I won from the community. I'm very happy. I'm not doing anything. I'm not giving him the chance to buy two development cards, two victory points and win. Damn, this was a close one. No, not even a seven. If I didn't get the nine here and he would have rolled a seven or I would have rolled a seven, we couldn't win. We, we would have been short one resource, but now it doesn't matter. We had the three, this is fine. Doesn't matter, we can do whatever can buy uh, at least a road doesn't really matter so let's see if they are sportmanship yeah they call it GG so I'm pretty happy I won I didn't lose a community game yet and I did win it on the way I want to win games right uh, four cities largest army 10 points GG well played there we go Yeah, but it was a fun game, it was very close, could have ended very, very differently. So we, we tied on Largest Army with, uh, with, with two other guys, and one of them had two. And only three of uh, the development cards were out. Uh, can you? Yeah, and there were only six, so out of these six, so it was also a one third chance of getting a victory point card if you would buy a development card. Uh, uh, Red, yeah, what what was Red's third uh, development card? Bob, Bob the Stoner. A uh, road building, road building. Yeah, you didn't. Yeah, the road building was did wasn't uh, of any usage for you. It was a very G, uh, very close game. I could have lost it easily. I was very very afraid that you uh, Bob would steal my largest army away. Uh, that last round, and then I. I probably would have lost or uh, yeah yeah because you would get largest army and I would go up to seven so it was a very close game very close game yeah fun I think I will uh, at least highlight this and maybe upload this one to YouTube it was a very close one very fun game so yeah and it was a cheesy strategy for me I didn't have any any wheat no grain and I won so it can be done you can win games without weed. Yeah, fun game, fun game, man.